Hey guys, it's Paolo. So today we have a great episode for you because we're talking to Jake Smollett, who has a new cooking series called Smollett Eats on the Food Network. Now, we all know the Smollett siblings for being amazing actors and singers, but wait until you see what they can do in the kitchen. They are so much fun to watch. See you all in the studio. His life was changed and made new when an angel made his dream come true. And now he brings his dream to you. In a powerful Are you good? I'm great. You're great. Oh, Jake says, if Jake says he's great, he is great. Okay, <laughs> I just want to say thank you for being here. We're so excited, thank really. You. Um, and congratulations on your show, Smollett Eat. Thank you. I mean, can I just, I want to start by saying this to you. Could you please open a restaurant here in LA? Because if you do, I promise you, I will be the first one in line. <laughs> no, I'm not joking. I will be because the food that I see you prepare on this show, it's like, ask Patrick, I want to go through the monitor and get what you're preparing. Thank so you. So good. And you have uh, Italian roots. Yeah, right? I got Italian, Italian roots. Nice. So when you did that second episode, we'll talk about it later. Yeah. I saw that pasta and yeah, all that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I know. Yeah, so that's right up your alley. Right? Let me ask you this. When you got the green light for this show, out of all your siblings, you have five, uh -huh. um, do you remember who you called first or who knew that this was a go, that this is happening? Everyone, because wow. we executive produced the show. Mm -hmm. So um, all of my siblings were in the room. Oh, we they were? Them. Yeah. <sighs> So this this has been a long time coming, actually. Wow. The whole process of you know selling the show it was greenlit last June, Gosh. Um, and we shot it in April. Wow, two week shoot and now it's airing. Yeah, it's there's fun. a quote you said when I was doing research. You said this, and I quote you, you said, this was six years ago and that I started producing my own cooking show. It's been in the works for a while, but everything happens with the right timing. It's yeah, so true. It's so true. Because nowadays people want things to happen. You know, right. Let's happen today or tomorrow, but you really, you worked your, let me say, butt off and <laughs> six years later, here you are, yeah. you know? Yeah. Um, before this, you and your brother Jesse, as we all know, before he became a breakout star mm -hmm. on Empire, you guys were doing videos, cooking videos on YouTube. Yeah, we were airing them on Transit TV, the so local cool. metro yep. system yep. out here. And originally I was shooting a show called Take 10. Yeah. It was basically showing people how to make, you know, home cooked meals for yeah. under $10. And That's awesome. Yeah, it was fun to do. And they were just three minute segments airing on the bus. Wow. And then Jesse and I started shooting another another show together called Restaurant Ready. It was like elevated home cooked meals. Mm. Uh, and then we had to stop airing them. Because of he, things of were Empire. happening with him yeah. and Empire. And after that, he was like, let's pick it back up. It was so fun, you know. Yeah. We went out and pitched it. They bought six episodes straight to series. That's so. amazing. In your wildest dream, did you ever imagine that you would have your own show with your siblings on the Food Network? Like, did that ever cross your mind? I mean, that's that's huge. It, it's It's so, it's, it's, well, to answer that question, yeah. yes, that mm -hmm. that definitely crossed my mind because that was the goal. Uh -huh. You know, the dream came. Oh, you true. had it inside, knowing that this is what I yeah, want. Yeah, that was definitely the end goal: is uh -huh. to end up on you know the number one name in food. Who doesn't want to be on Food Network? Hello, you know, yeah, show, you know. But yeah, so that was the goal. But for it to actually have happened, mm. it's that's huge. I'm happy. Wow, definitely. and I I heard that one of your favorite episodes. I think it's the barbecue episode airing September 10th on yeah. Saturday, and that is because all your siblings are going to be a part of it. Yeah. What was that like for you? Because you all have crazy schedules, you know. I know right. that, but to have everyone there on this show, what did that? What was that like for you taping that day? It was a it was a ruckus. Day. Oh my <laughs> gosh, so fun, but like it feels like crime mm. being there with your family. Like it doesn't even feel like work. It feels God. like these people should like. We should give them their money back. Cause oh my! Like, <laughs> not say work. That. We're gonna take that out. Don't you dare say because if your siblings watches or anyone, no. <laughs> no, but really though, it's like that definitely was my favorite episode yeah. shot because it's the one where all six of us are in it. And mm, I cannot the wait. The food is fun. We do ribs, chicken wings, <sighs> smoked mac and cheese, mm. drunken peaches. Oh my god, drunken peaches. Yeah. What? Oh my, my sister gosh. Jazz does drunken peaches like. <sighs> Oh my God. Can I tell you one of my, I mean, it was the second episode because he, you know, I'm Italian. So when you did that pasta dish yeah. and then I found out that you actually learned how to make pasta in Italy. Yeah. I mean, my mother who's from Italy, I told her to watch it. She said, 
thumbs up. She approves of you. Oh, thank I mean, you. That's, that's thank a, you, Mama. Yeah, thank you, Mama Pasta, okay? <laughs> Who's watching this right that's now. A, I mean, that's a huge compliment <laughs> from an Italian mother. But that like, shows how much you love what you're doing. It's not just something you welcome. said, hey, I'm going to start cooking something, you yeah. know? Like, you, this is something you knew inside yeah. that you wanted to do, and you're doing it. Thank you. What was that like making pasta in Italy? What was that experience it was, like? It's, it was one of the best experiences. It taught me a lot about cooking oh. and I vowed to wherever I travel like new exotic places yeah. to do a cooking class with Smart. you know a chef at even a hotel or mm. like just to learn the the authentic flavors and how they do yes. a marinara that's sauce that's the best you know? way to learn the best way is to go there see what they do try yeah. to incorporate and then make it your style your yeah, yeah. way that's amazing. That's great. You know, when I was doing some research on you, I came across this picture, which I think ah. it's from 19, 1994, right? Is it 1994, right? That was 94. Yep. On our own. The yeah. show you guys did, you and your siblings. Yeah. Um, when you look at this, tell me, like, <laughs> and you look at you guys now today, I mean, how proud are you of all of, I mean, all your siblings? You know what we have There had. he is right over here, by the way. That's me. That's my little brother, yep. Jockey, yep. Jojo, Jesse, Jazz, Jazz Journey. And Journey, yeah. I mean, that's yeah, amazing. I mean, we've had some fun times. Like, mm. working together is just a blast. I wouldn't trade it for the world. Do you guys all, I mean, because even on the show, when I watch the show, you guys are always joking, having fun, you and yeah. your brothers too, even when Jazz won the first episode. Is it like that even when the cameras aren't rolling? Because I have six siblings. I'm, uh, we're seven total. Yeah. And, you know, we're always really? having fun. So yeah. you have a big family. So I understand. That's why yeah, I like your nice. show. Big so families. I understand that. So for you, are you guys always having fun, like what we see on camera? Or is there sometimes it's like some, uh, hold on over there. Always having fun. That's awesome. That's not a lie. Everything's amazing. Oh, there he is! That is until my sisters show up and crash my party. It's a real sibling smackdown as my sisters put their oyster po' boy head to head against my taco. If you guys like these, you can try an oyster po' boy. May the best smallette win. Game Journey is one. over. It's you one. Shut it down, Jack. Drop the mic. Drop the mic! <laughs> And then, just for those, you're tuning in, and this is from the, one of the episodes, I believe. This is from the barbecue. The barbecue one. Yeah, yeah. September 10th. And we did a midnight barbecue. All the friends came out. Wow. Really, really fun episode. That was, that was a lot of fun. Let me ask you this. I'm curious, because you guys are so close. Can you give me one word to describe each, starting with Jojo, your brother? Oh. One word. Uh, protector. He's Ooh. like the protector of the family. Because he's the sure. oldest one, I'm assuming, He's the right? oldest, and oh, he, Virgo season right now. He's a Virgo. Oh, and yeah. He, he is watch. the protector for sure. Oh, I got the chills. That's that's beautiful. Um, of course, Jesse. Comedy. Mm. Jesse's hilarious. Even in the oh show, I see he's always making jokes and stuff. Jesse yeah. is hilarious. Wow. Journey. Uh, Journey is sweetie. She's such a sweetie pie. Mm. Both of my sisters. Mm, Jess. Yeah. I would name them both sweet. Uh, Jackie. Jackie is my lion brother, Ooh. fellow Leo. Yeah. You gotta give me one to describe you. What about yourself? <laughs> uh, me. It's a good question. Um, it's hard to describe yourself with one word. Uh, if I had to say one word, loyal. Ooh. Very loyal. That's good. Yeah. I want to add another one and say that you are talented. Oh, thank in you. In so many different ways, you really are. So. Thank you so much. Yeah. You were six years old when you knew that you wanted, I think you, like, I am going to start cooking. Were you six years old when you kind of knew that feeling? Yeah, I first made Italian food. Oh, so you remember the dish Italian too? Food, yeah. Italian food. Yeah, was it, what mom, was it? My mom makes such delicious marinara sauce. Oh. Like, she, she will use so many vegetables, garlic, mm. onions, all. That's what my mom does. Vegetables. That's true, like, yeah. true. It's not from the canned. Yeah, yeah. She's got that machine too right. that she makes it. Oh, I love that. Right. No canned. No canned tomato paste or none of that. It's like wow. fresh tomatoes. So I learned from her. She's from New Orleans. Yeah, yeah. So uh, the first dish I made was lasagna. Oh, wow. Served it for my family at six years old. And I they all... made the whole thing from scratch. And my mom just let me go oh and do my it. Gosh, that's so cool. Yeah. I love that you remember that. Um, let me. I was thinking also. You all have start with the letter J. Even your parents. And is there a reason why? Because I was just so curious. Is there a reason why, or is it just? Like, let's just start it with Well, all... it started because... Well, my parents are, are hippies. They were like... <laughs> hippie dippy. But um, it started because both of them are J. Ah, yeah. right, right. So they just went with that and had to come up with six J names. Wow. And in the process, 
created some new names like Journey and Jesse. Wow. And, you know, Which, jockey, beautiful, I mean, like, yeah, yeah, beautiful name. Yeah, cool You guys name. do know that your, your parents started this before the Kardashians, because I even looked this up. <laughs> they all have Ks, but they were after, so your parents started this first, the trend. So I want to make that very clear, so that's J, really cool. J, J. That's, yeah, that's really cool. <laughs> do you have a favorite ingredient? Because you're the expert. Like, for me, I said this earlier, it's Nutella. I can yeah. bake with Nutella with everything. Do you have, like, yeah. a favorite ingredient? My favorite ingredient is garlic. Ooh, which and helps out a lot in every dish. You know, a lot of people don't really like garlic yeah. because they think it smells your breath. Smells gonna your breath, smell. and, yeah. you know, all that stuff. But if I used you to, cook I used it to in think a certain that way, as a kid, but not yeah. anymore. Yeah, but it's all yeah, cooking it's it in a certain way. It's all in how way. you cook it. If you saute it, sweat it out before you add everything in there, then yeah. you don't really you don't really get that stench of the raw garlic. Yeah, yeah. Um, garlic, cayenne pepper is another favorite of Ooh, mine. Ooh, that's a good one, yes, yes. Definitely my New Orleans roots. Ooh, New Orleans roots. Yeah. That's where Patrick's from. Well, Louisiana. Really? Yeah. Yeah. New Iberia. Nice. We'll talk after, but yeah, that's, yeah. yeah, yeah he's yeah, got yeah. some things to tell you. Um, <laughs> and let me tell you how special this guy is, because then on September 16, you're gonna be on the Rachel Ray Show. I think yes. you're on like at least six episodes. Yeah. I mean, let me say, once you've made it to Rachel Ray, you know that, okay, that's it. What is that going to be like for you, you think? Oh my gosh. I mean, I can't even describe another dream come true, oh. what I always say. It's like, that again was a goal to cook with Rachel Ray one day. Mm. You know, I always said I want to want to do what she did for home cooks, you know, wow. just show people new home recipes that they can throw down with. And going cook with her is like, what? Like, yeah. I mean, it's <laughs> Rachel Ray, like, <laughs> definitely, you know? So, very excited to do that. That's so amazing. Yeah. I cannot, September 16, I cannot wait. Thank you, you know, when I watch, when I watch your show, um, I think it's in the first episode, you guys made these cupcakes. I think they were lavender lemon. Yeah. When I saw that, I, and I love, I, I bake more than cooking. When I saw okay. I said that, I'm so curious. So this morning, I got up early and I said, first of all, there's two ingredients that are pretty amazing. There's lemon oil, which I didn't even know yeah. what lemon oil was. Yeah. And lavender, because I never like, I was, I love the smell of it, but cooking with it. Right. So this morning, I'm, I have a surprise for you. Bring them out, Patrick. I want you, because you're the expert, so I want, he's going to taste one, and you're, gonna, you're not going to lie to me. You're going to tell me if you like him, how I did, because I was a little bit nervous, okay? Great. So, My sister okay. would be thrilled with a jazz, this. Jazz, because it's jazz ingredients. Yeah. It's jazz, jazz ingredients. Okay, so you're going to take one. Look at and, these. <laughs> oh, because what? yours are so better. So you're just, what? just lying. <laughs> so you try, and you're going to tell Paolo if it was good, because if it's good, I'm going to go to bed so happy tonight, knowing that the expert over here said that they're good. Yo, I'm gonna just take a piece. I mean, there's lemon oil, people, and lavender inside this. That's a first for me that I, like, if, if I wasn't watching your show, I would not know that. Good stuff right here. Really? You okay. killed it. I, 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 believe, I believe it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. This is great. This, oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna eat the whole thing. We're gonna have wow. the recipe on spoonfulpal.com, and you gotta thank your sister for this recipe as well, because, I mean. Definitely will. I gotta say, with lavender in them, that. it's really, really good. It gives that it a good delicious. flavor. Really? That is delicious. Oh, okay. You knocked it out of the park with that Really? Okay, okay. <laughs> I just wanna say, thank you. You're just. Thank you, Paolo. I'm so happy for you. Anyone who's living their dream and six years to get to this show and it's happening, I just want to say it's, it's inspiring to all of us, to me. So keep doing it. Thank you so I'm so much. proud of you, okay? Thank you so much. And he's going to invite me over for dinner, he said. Definitely. <laughs> right? Yeah, yeah. You both have to come yeah, over. We're going to come <laughs> over. All right, don't forget, Smollett Eats. Um, you can catch Sat it's Saturdays, right? Yes. 12 30, 11 30 Central Time. Yes. Um, yeah, it's just the Food Network channel. I can't wait. Definitely. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Oh my God. Okay, bye everyone. Thank bye. you. We'll see you next time. Spoonful of Apollo. <laughs> Mwah. Do you really like them? I love that. <laughs> Yo, I'm about to eat this right now. <laughs> Spoonful of follow. <laughs> I love you, Oprah. Bye, everyone. We'll see you next time. Bye. Thank you.